Besides the huge library of pre-made DV layouts, that is at a moment near impressive 2000 library items, DVDEM Pro provides you with some additional features. Did you know that you could create website templates using the DVDEM Pro plugin? Now, you might be thinking, hold on, isn't that what DV already has? Well, for one, we had our team builder even before DV had theirs. And still, we have some features that DV team doesn't have yet. So bear with me as I'm going to show you what exactly. To find the templates for the plugin team builder, go to team builder and the plugin team builder tab. Save 404 coming soon or search results pages navigation menus or archive templates. Besides that, you can save pop-ups or sticky bars. To use these templates and see additional features, go to Appearance, Customize, or just click this button here. To use pages and blog page templates, you can use the first two options here. However, this is something that you can do through the DV Team Builder now. If you toggle DVDEM Pro Global Settings, you can find some additional features here. For example, you can customize the default DV mobile menu. You can choose from a few of our pre-made layouts and you can customize the mobile menu. One useful additional option is to use global headings. This allows you to customize the headings across your website, uh, all here from these settings. So these settings are going to override all the headings on your website. It is going to override the module and theme settings. This is useful if you would like to customize the headings from one place and make them unified. Sticky bar option allows you to have a sticky bar at the top or at the bottom of your website. Pop-up customizer is where you can set up pop-ups for your website. You can save pre-made pop-ups from our library or create your own ones and display it from here. Once you save a pop-up layout, it is going to appear here under this drop down menu. There are some additional settings you want to check. Uh, when do you want to show the pop up, whether on the page load or on click. And there are some other options too. Login, register and lost password allows you to brand this page. This is the default WordPress login page. There are three pre-made layouts at the moment that you can select and customize. You can change all the colors and graphics. Also, you can add more icons to Divi. You can enable font awesome and material design icons. This adds more icons to the list. For example, in the case of the blurb module, where you can select an icon to show, uh, once you select these two options, more you will have more icons to select from. Customize back to top button. This is the button, button that shows at the right bottom corner of your website when you scroll down the page. To be able to use this option, you have to enable this button from the DV team options. And then you can come back here to customize it. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.